lovely viewers, you are most welcome to our channel Poetry Online. In this video, we shall be discussing the WASI 2021 Literature in English Objective Questions and Answers. Kindly subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon to get updates on all our new videos. Once again, let us assure you of a very interesting discussion. Get ready for this lesson. Section A. Answer all the questions in this section. Part I. General Knowledge of Literature Question 1. Something a character says on stage that is meant for the audience alone is A. An aside B. An epilogue C. A mime D. A soliloquy The correct answer to this question is A. An aside Question 2. A pause within a line of poetry is A. An alliteration B. An assonance C. A caesura D. A meter The correct answer to this question is C. A caesura Question 3. A recurring idea, image, or a group of images that unify a work of literature is A. Allusion B. Anecdote C. Legend D. Motive The correct answer to this question is D. Motive Question 4 When you are old and grey and full of sleep, the rhythmic pattern of the above line is A. Anapestic B. Ditalic C. Iambic D. Trochiac The correct answer to this question is C. Iambic Question 5. An inscription on a tombstone is an A. Epigram B. Episode C. Epitaph D. Ode The correct answer to this question is C. Epitaph Question 6. A three-line stanza rhymed A, B, A, B, C, B, C, D, C, S, A, a couplet B Heiku C heroic couplet D Tesarima The correct answer to this question is D Tesarima Question 7 The chorus normally features prominently in A drama B poetry C. The epic D. The novel The correct answer to this question is B. Poetry Question 8 A story which explains a natural phenomenon or justifies the belief of a society is A. Fable B. Legend C. Motive D. Myth the correct answer to this question is B. Legend Read the extract below and answer questions 9 to 11. What happens to a dream deferred? Does it dry up like a raisin in the sun? Or fester like a sore and then run? Does it stink like rotten meat? The extract again. What happens to a dream deferred? Does it dry up like a raisin in the sun? Or fester like a saw and then run? Does it stink like rotten meat? Question 9 The dominant literary device is A. Verbal irony B. Paradox C. The epitaph. D. 
The rhetorical question. The correct answer to this question is D. The rhetorical question. Question 10. Does this thing like rotten meat makes use of the sense of A. Sight B. Smell C. Taste D. Touch The correct answer to this question is B. Smell Question 11. The mood of the poem is one of A. Anger B. Certainty C. Doubt D. Joy The correct answer to this question is C. Doubt Question 12 A short play performed in the pause between the act of a longer play is A. Epilogue B. Denouement C. Interlude D. Prologue the correct answer to this question is C. Interlude Question 13 The most intense part of a conflict is there A. Climax B. Denouement C. Duzes Machina D. Resolution The correct answer to this question is A. Climax Question 14 I feel a million times better than I felt yesterday is A. An apostrophe B. A euphemism C. A hyperbole D. An irony The correct answer to this question is C. A hyperbole Question 15 Identify the odd item A. A personary technique B. First person narrative C. Literary appreciation D. Third person narrative The correct answer to this question is C. Literary appreciation Question 16 A dramatist is someone who dash plays a. Commissions plays B. Directs plays C. Promotes plays D. Writes plays The correct answer to this question is D. A dramatist is someone who writes plays. Question 17 Nando's family lives within the lower income bracket illustrates A. Allusion B. Climax C. Euphemism D. Sarcasm The correct answer to this question is C. Euphemism Question 18 A dramatic performance without words is A. An aside B. A mime C. A monologue D. A soliloquy the correct answer to this question is B. A mime. Question 19. Utopia is a term used to describe A. Ideal societies B. Difficult conditions C. Pleasant feelings D. Strange circumstances The correct answer to this question is A. Ideal societies Question 20 The lawyer addressed the bench illustrates A. Alliteration B. Oxymoron C. Metonymy D. Simile The correct answer to this question is C. Metonymy Part II Unseen prose and poetry. Read a passage below and answer questions 21 to 25. Passage When he was little, he would ask his mother sometimes as he lay in the cool little room and looked up at her as she sat beside his bed stroking his hair. 
while two boys from his class had thrown stones at a dog, and while on another occasion, a gang of them had broken into an empty house, smashing the thick door which had killed moldings on the front, which had been turned by carpenters years before, or why he had ended up in a fight, which had begun when a little girl had shouted names at him, which made no sense about his house and his family, and others had joined in, and he had rushed at them, scattering them, as some shrieked, and some laughed, and he flayed about with his hard little fist and tears in his eyes. His mother would smile, say shh, and he would drift to sleep with a hard shape of a mother's face imprinted on his mind. The passage again. Passage. When he was little, he would ask his mother sometimes as he lay in the cold little room and looked up at her as she sat beside his bed stroking his hair. Why two boys from his class had thrown stones at a dog? Why on another occasion, a gang of them had broken into an empty house, smashing the thick door which had killed moldings on the front, which had been turned by carpenters years before? Or why he had ended up in a fight, which had begun when a little girl had shouted names at him? which made no sense about his house and his family, and others had joined in, and he had rushed at them, scattering them, as some shrieked and some laughed, and he flayed about with his hard little fist and tears in his eyes. His mother would smile, say shh, and he would drift to sleep with a hard shape of a mother's face imprinted on his mind. Question 21 the dominant feeling in the passage is that of A. Anger B. Expectancy C. Fear D. Nostalgia The correct answer to this question is D. Nostalgia Question 22 The feeling is conveyed by A. The boy's actions B. The tender care of his mother. C. The little girl's towns. D. The moldings on the door. The correct answer to this question is A. The boy's actions. Question 23. The dominant literal device in the passage is A. Antithesis. B. Littles. C. Paralysis D. Personification Question 24 And he had rushed at them, scattering them, as some shrieked and some laughed, illustrates A. Climax B. Metaphor C. Metonymy D. Onomatopoeia Question 25. The main character is A. Humorous B. Inquisitive C. Playful D. Sad The correct answer to this question is B. Inquisitive Read the point below and answer questions 26 to 30. We wear the mask that grins and lies. It hides our cheeks and shades our eyes. This depth we pay to human girl. A torn and bleeding heart we smile. And mouths with miry subtle ties. Why should the world be overwise? In counting all our tears and sighs. Nay, let them only see us. While we wear the marks. We smile, but oh great God. Our cries to thee from tortured souls arise. We sing, but oh, the clay is vile. Beneath our feet, and long the mile, but let the world dream otherwise. We wear the mask. The poem again. Read the poem below and answer questions 26 to 30. We wear the mask that grins and lies. 
It hides our cheeks and shades our eyes. This depth we pay to human gall. A torn and bleeding heart with smile. And mouths with mirrors subtle ties. Why should the world be overwise? In counting all our tears and sighs. Nay, let them only see us while we wear the marks. We smile, but oh great God, our cries to thee from tortured souls arise. We sing, but oh the clay is vile. Beneath our feet and long the mile, but let the world dream otherwise. We wear the mask. Question 26. The poem is about a. Appearances B. Costumes C. Depths D. Dreams The correct answer to this question is A. Appearances Question 27 The poet's tone is A. Conciliatory B. Complaint C. Defiant D. Supplicatory The correct answer to this question is B. Complaint Question 28 The rhyme scheme of the first stanza is A. 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 B. B. C B. A. A. B. C. C C. A B A B A D A B B A C The correct answer to this question is C A B A B A Question 29 The dominance mood is one of A fear B joy C. Optimism D. Sadness The correct answer to this question is C. Optimism Question 30 We wear the marks that grins and lies Illustrates A. Alliteration B. Irony C. Personification D. Synecdoche the correct answer to this question is C. Personification Section B. Answer all the questions in this section. William Shakespeare Read the extract below and answer questions 31 to 35. Speaker X You do impeach your modesty too much to leave the city and commit yourself into the hands of one that loves you not to trust the opportunity of night and the ill counsel of a desert place with the rich word of your virginity. Speaker Y, your virtue is my privilege, for that is not night when I do see your face. Therefore, I think I am not in the night. This extract is taken from Act 2, Scene 1, lines 214 to 222. The extract again. Speaker X. You do impeach your modesty too much to leave the city and commit yourself into the hands of one that loves you not to trust the opportunity of night and the ill counsel of a desert place with the rich word of your virginity. Speaker Y, your virtue is my privilege, for that is not night when I do see your face. Therefore, I think I am not in the night. This extract is taken from Act 2, Scene 1, lines 214 to 222. Question 31. Speaker X is A. Demetrius B. Hemia C. Lysander D. Philostrate The correct answer to this question is A. 
Demetrius. Question 32. Speaker Y is A. Helena B. Hippolyta C. Pez Blossom D. Titania The correct answer to this question is A. Helena Question 33 Speaker X C. Speaker Y A. For the first time B. As a pretender C. As a past lover D. For the last time The correct answer to this question is C. As a past lover Question 34 Both speakers are in the woods A. For different reasons B. For the same reason. C. To hide from each other. D. To spy on each other. The correct answer to this question is A. For different reasons. Question 35. Night evolves in the speakers. A. Contrasting feelings. B. Despairing thoughts C. Erotic feelings D. Huge responsibilities The correct answer to this question is A. Contrasting feelings Read the extract below and answer questions 36 to 40. But masters, here are our parts and I am to entreat you request you and desire you to call them by tomorrow night and meet me in the place wood a mile without the town by moonlight there will we rehearse for if we meet in the city we shall be doors with company and our devices known this extract is taken from act one scene two lines 79 to 84 the extract again but masters, here are our parts, and I am to entreat you, request you, and desire you to call them by tomorrow night, and meet me in the place wood, a mile without the town by moonlight. There will we rehearse, for if we meet in the city, we shall be doors with company, and our devices known. This extract is taken from Act 1, Scene 2. Line 79 to 84. Question 36. The speaker is A. Bottom B. Queens C. Pears Blossom D. Pork The correct answer to this question is B. Queens. Question 37. The speaker is addressing a. Artists B. Actors C. Painters D. Writers The correct answer to this question is B. Actors Question 38 They intend to rehearse the play A. Pyramus and Tisby B. A Midsummer Night's nice Dream C. The Tragedy of Lovers D. The Battle Royal The correct answer to this question is A. Pyramus and Tisby Question 39 The rehearsal is in preparation for A. Egos' Acceptance of Lysander B. Teusus' Wedding C. The Dance of the Fairies D. Titania Waking Up from a Dream The correct answer to this question is B. Teusus' Wedding Question 40 The main actors will be 
A. Snack and snout. B. Philostrate and stubbling. C. Queens and bottom. D. Bottom and mustard seed. The correct answer to this question is C. Queens and bottom. Read the extract below and answer questions 41 to 45. Speaker X. I pray thee, gentle mortal, sing again. My ear is much enamored by thy notes, so is my eye entrailed by thy shape, and thy fair virtues for us performs do move me. On the first view, to say, to swear, I love thee. Speaker Y, methinks, mistress, you should have little reason for that. This extract is taken from Atheris in 2, lines 116 to 121. The extract again, Speaker X, I pray thee, gentle mortal, sing again. My ear is much enamored by thy notes, so is my eye entrailed by thy shape, and thy fair virtues for us performs do move me. On the first view, to say, to swear, I love thee. Speaker Y, methinks, mistress, you should have little reason for that. This extract is taken from Atheris in 2, lines 116. To 121. Question 41. Speaker Y is A. Oberon, B. Hippolyta, C. Snout, D. Titania. The correct answer to this question is D. Titania. Question 42. Speaker X has just a. Abandoned a loved one. B. Escaped from the city. C. Fallen into a world of dreams. D. Woken up from induced sleep. The correct answer to this question is C. Fallen into a world of dreams. Question 43. Speaker Y is A. Bottom B. Demetrius C. Queens D. Lysander The correct answer to this question is A. Bottom Question 44 Speaker Y is a member of A. The group of actors B. The group of lovers. C. Theusis's retinue. D. Titania's retinue. The correct answer to this question is A. The group of actors. Question 45. Speaker X's speech can be described as A. Conceit. B. Paradox C. Parody D. Satire The correct answer to this question is D. Satire Read the extract below and answer questions 46 to 50. If we offend, it is with good will that you should think we come not to offend, but with good will to show you our simple skill. That is the true beginning of our end. Consider then, we come, but in despite. We do not come, as minding to content you. Our true intent is. This extract is taken from Act 4, Scene 1, lines 108-114. The extract again. If we offend, it is with good will that you should think 
we come not to offend, but with good will, to show you our simple skill. That is the true beginning of our end. Consider then, we come, but in despite, we do not come, as minding to content you. Our true intent is, this extract is taken from Act 4, Scene 1, Lines 108-114. Question 46. The speaker is A. Bottom B. Flute C. Philostrate D. Queens The correct answer to this question is D. Queens Question 47. The speech is part of the A. Epilogue B. Exposition C. Lyric D. Prologue The correct answer to this question is D. Prologue Question 48 The speaker is involved in putting on A. An Act B. A Play C. A scene. D. A skit. The correct answer to this question is B. A play. Question 49. The occasion is A. A baron's threat to punish Titania. B. Titania falling in love with Button. C. The celebration of the royal marriage. D. The king's decision to banish Hemia. The correct answer to this question is C. The celebration of the royal marriage. Question 50. The speech is A. Comic B. Romantic C. Satiric D. Tragic the correct answer to this question is A. Comic. End of paper. Thanks for watching this video. Please don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share this video.